Hi everyone, uh, thanks for coming back. Today we're going to take a look at how to install some antivirus onto our system and what my opinion is of the best antivirus uh, right now, especially for Windows, is uh, this free antivirus called AVG. Um, that's what we're going to install today is the AVG. Uh, many people out there have uh, Norton antivirus. I highly recommend to switch over. You'll see a vast improvement on your computer speed and um, just it works much better. But regardless, say all you need to do to download it is um, we'll start by going to Google. And if you just type in AVG, you can see that it comes up right away. Just free AVG download. And we'll just surf to that web page. And if you look right in the middle screen, it says uh, AVG Antivirus Free Edition. Click down here at the bottom. And then it'll take us to uh, CNET, which is uh, a good place to download from. And this is the AVG 9.0. It's brand new, so it is an upgrade from the 8.5 that's been released for a while. I already have it installed right here, but you'll see that what it'll do is um, it'll ask you to download the file, and it should come up, and you'll see right here that uh, Internet Ex Internet Securities will block the file until you click up here and say Download File, and then it'll let you download the file. I, I would save it to your desktop, so just on your desktop and just let it save um, just let this go for a couple of minutes and then once you have it completely downloaded uh, just go ahead and start to install it uh, so I'll see you in a second um, and just let this thing download okay um, now that you see that this is downloading it's almost done now uh, I will close this back window um, when Nor sorry, when AVG is installing, uh, you do need to make sure all your Explorer and Firefox windows are closed. So you'll see that uh, it has finished downloading now. It's just going to take a couple of seconds to just get the file onto my desktop. And there you go. And you can just go ahead and either run it or double click it from your desktop. And it will bring you into the screen. Just hit run. Uh, the best thing that I could suggest to anybody is to just read through when you are installing you don't have to read every single word just you do have to read though make sure you're not installing anything that you, is unwanted like a, a toolbar or something as you can see this is um, pretty straightforward just hit next there's only a couple options for uh, languages uh, pick English hit next um, you can read through the agreement here like most people out there they don't uh, just accept it and you can keep on going and what it, this is going to do now is it's just going to go ahead and install AVG onto your computer. And you can see that it's going to go through the process of um, looking at your files, uh, uninstalling. If you do have AVG 8.5 or anything earlier than that, it will automatically uninstall for you. If you have another antivirus that is not AVG, um, you will have to remove it before you can install this. This will also give you warning saying you will have to remove the other antivirus before you can install this. Um, good practice, only have one antivirus, not many. Uh, big, th big thing. You can't have a lot of uh, antiviruses out there. So as you can see now, getting back to this, uh, you'll see, instead of, see how you see three here for me, um, when you're looking at yours it should only give you two options one should be standard one should be custom I always choose custom and then as you're going through uh, it will automatically fill in the license for you and it's going to give you this one section where um, it'll ask you if you want to install the AVG toolbar please select don't or unselect the highlighted bar and then just hit next and once you're finished it's going to ask you to restart your computer and then once you're done it will restart and you will have this little icon on your bottom right hand corner and there you go you have Norton sorry AVG 9.0 on your system now I keep on wanting to say Norton but um, avoid it avoid Norton uh, anyways thank you for uh, staying with me take care bye bye